the theme of this year's Work Zone Awareness Week states, work zones are temporary. Actions behind the wheel can last forever. Our message to motorists is to slow down. I can't say that enough. Everybody needs to slow down. I do want to specifically acknowledge um, our two workers, Renee Rangel and James Edward Lockwood. I think it's important to not acknowledge and remember their specific names. These are people who have people who love them and still do. We can reach a reality in Michigan where we do have zero people pass away in incidents and work zones. We're working with all of our entities, uh, all of our partners, the Federal Highway Administration, on something called the safe system approach. And we have to acknowledge that humans are gonna make mistakes. So we need to do everything we can do, not just from a, a pavement marking and signing uh, perspective, but what else can we do to anticipate what those mistakes could be and, and really try to eliminate those? Because at the end of the day, our goal is still toward zero deaths in the work zones and out of the work zones. MIDA and uh, several contractors in MDOT formed what we call the uh, Work Zone Safety Task Force. And the first item that came up on that agenda uh, was camera enforcement. We think we have the data, we think we have the ideas to do this properly, but to date camera enforcement hasn't been passed. We're trying to take people out of harm's way. We're trying to uh, help people on both sides of the barrels because it's not just workers, it's the people that drive through them. It's not a gotcha, it's a, it's, it's we got you. All of us have someone who cares about us. Maybe we should care a little bit more about them. Maybe we could be a little bit more mindful about the decisions that we make when we are behind the wheel. Because as the theme of this uh, event shares, that the actions that we take and the decisions that we make have lifelong consequences, or at least they can.